Alright, my longest video on YouTube, most likely. Welcome to my Q&A. My first ever question and answer Q&A ever. I am not big enough on YouTube yet to have a, an actual like question question and answer where you guys ask me. Maybe eventually, I hope so. But I'm just going to take a bunch of general questions about me, everything, um, and answer them. So, yeah. So, oh, the boat, I, I trashed that for some reason. I don't know. I don't know. I'll pick up video coming soon. So, let's get right into it. We're going to start with my life. Life unit. Now, um, let's... This unit, I'm not going to give weird questions, I might do some questions that are a bit strange, or you think I wouldn't answer, but, no, whatever. So first off, there it is, when was I born? I think everybody knows when I was born. Oh, I think you can make that conclusion, if you've watched my videos whatsoever, I think you can make that conclusion, I'm not even going to say it. You have to find that out for yourself, so, I think it should be pretty obvious. How old am I? 13. My name, Ben, obviously, my freaking channel name. Um, last name, Ru Ben, Rook, Lego, Ben R. Lego. Makes sense. Um, I know I'm kind of rushing this at the beginning, I'm just getting the crap out of the way. Like, everybody knows that. How old am I? 13, I already said that. Um, oh, here's a Q&A for you guys. I, we're not Q&A, here's a trick for you guys. I've been doing you I've been on YouTube. My first appearance in a YouTube video was over seven years ago. So huh, I made it seven years. I actually want to make it to seven years on my YouTube channel though. Um what do I view more or like what do I value? No, I'm gonna do my YouTube questions here. Um or not not my YouTube questions yet. I just wanna kinda go through that. Um what I'm just gonna do my views or everything. Um, favorite food. That's a hard one. Um, baked potatoes, scrambled eggs are good. Lettuce, I love lettuce. Lettuce and carrots, I love lettuce and carrots. Um, that's it for me mainly. Um, baked potatoes, scrambled eggs, lettuce, um, carrots. Especially um thin, thinner carrots, not the big ones, just so I can chew on them easier. I don't know. I don't know. Um, ever drink chocolate milk? Um, here's the thing: if chocolate milk is unhealthy for you, I would have probably actually died at this point, or I would have serious medical issues. Considering the fact that I drank chocolate milk like three times a day for. 11 years, maybe? Something like that. So, I think... I think I'm fine. Um, especially considering that, um... I don't have that many health problems, so... Yeah, chocolate milk, um... Yeah, I'm a huge fan of chocolate milk. I love chocolate milk. Water can be very good. Water can be very good. Depends. Um, on what kind of water it is, all that kind of... Spring water. Spring water. Try spring water. I haven't had it. I will about it. Favorite junk food. Here we go. You don't want to do this to me. You ask me that. Reese's peanut butter cups. I guess. Um. No. I've always been a fan of um. Hershey's. I just, I just love chocolate. I'm chocolate junkie. I actually don't have chocolate that much. I really don't. Um, that's a luxury food for me now. I don't have to talk about that much. Um. Oh, I. Really? No freaking way. My heater started. Huh. That's strange. My heater started. I don't know why. My heater just started. It. It's June 20. It's actually June 30th by the time I'm... It's June 30th, I'm like 
something a.m., 4 a.m., um, and I'm hot right now. I have a fan right here. Heater's freaking out. Kidding me? This is probably messed up my computer. Um, sorry about this. Getting more wrinkles for a minute. Um, so yeah, Hershey's, just all that stuff. Now my views, my views. Religion. I can't even give you my opinion on religion. I do believe that there is a God. I believe... I believe that... That kind of stuff... Is... True or possible, depending on what it is. Um... Because, you know, I do Qigong. Or... You know, Qigong is a... Exercise. The... Energy. But... I'm not a particularly re religious person. I guess I would be considered a Christian, I guess. I don't know. I have no clue. Now, one thing. Enough of you people with um, radical Islam. Yeah, radical Christianity. Look it up. It's real. There's every single freaking religion. Radical. Every single one has it. Also, here's my thing about the Bible and all that book. On those books. They've been changed so much over the past thousand years. Two thousand years. How? I don't know. I'm not even going to go into it. Um, view on politics. I don't care for politics because it's just fear mongering in my opinion. Like, most of that stuff is ridiculous. I don't know why you'd want to follow that. Because you can't, most people, most of you people, they follow um, politics. You have no effect on it. I'm sorry to say, but you have no effect on politics. I don't have effect on it, so I don't worry about it. My Democrat, Demo why be a Democrat or a Republican? Democrat, but that's just me. My views on feminism. Okay, the term feminism, the equality, equality, whatever. Oh, it's it's late. I'm tired. Um. Equality, I'm all for that. But radical feminism is a real thing. Social justice warriors, I'm literally going to do something about that. <laughs> so, yeah, just me. And just my views on everything. Views on homosexuality, trans, like LGBT or whatever it was. I don't even remember anymore. I don't care. Live your life how you want to live it. Unless, of course, you're going to kill a bunch of people or something. I don't need that. But... If you want to be gay, who cares? It doesn't matter. It's fine. Like, I don't see why people. I don't want people. Like, you see these people, like, oh, we're on this giant crusade. You want to get gays abolished or whatever the heck it was. Like, your life will mean nothing. You won't be seen as an online terrorist or anything like that. I don't know. I don't even know what the term is for them. But they are idiots. You can't stop people from. It's how they're born. I'm, t I'm tired of that crap. It makes me so frustrated. Like, let people do what they want to do. It's their life, not yours. So stay out of it. Um, and now, we segment. This segment's right into my next segment. <laughs> if anyone gets that reference. Sexuality, I have no freaking clue. I'm 13, it doesn't matter. Yeah. I don't know. I'd, as of right now, I'd say bisexual, but that what I'll say, because I don't know. I don't know yet. I'm not sure. So that also is another thing people would ask: Am I with someone? No. No, I'm not. <laughs> like why? I don't know why you'd want to ask me that question. Um. I mean. There's someone I could be with in technical terms, and you know who you are, because you've probably been watching this dang video, you'll make it far enough in this, you know who you are. Um, but, yeah, I'm just sorry. Um, now, I'm going to do a little bit of a health thing here. Health questions. Headaches. I have migraines. Heat. It's like a giant heat ray is generating from my forehead. And if I suppress that heat, if I get a cold rag put up on my head, it suppresses that pain. It's not because 
pressure, even though I do get pressure on my skull. Um, it's it's something else. Um, it's a medical mystery. No one knows what it is. Um, uh, most people that we've actually seen think it's fake. So yeah, I guess. I've had two eye surgeries. One of them was my first memory, like 2004 or 5. Um, yeah, I was born cross-eyed. Um, yeah, so I basically only have one good eye, even at that. It doesn't work as well as um, most other people's eye would work. Um, I know my grammar is going to be terrible. I'm so sorry, I'm tired. Um, now, shaking. Shaking. You're going to ask me about trembles, whatever you want to call it. I don't know. I really don't know. It's random. It seems to be when I'm stressed out. I always... My hands are not steady. I've always had to shake. It's always frustrated me, but there are certain times where I'm like, you know, everybody, everybody, I'm freaking, I'll be holding a game case, and I'm... Everybody knows that at this point. I've made, I've made a joke of it, but... Yeah. Um, at this point... I don't know. So yeah, I don't know. Even though I do believe it had to do with the chaos war, so that stresses you out. Okay, if you were to fight a war against online terrorism, basically, and you heard people, if you heard people killing themselves, you probably would get messed up because of that. Also, if your friend, if you lost one of your best friends to suicide, um, you'd be pretty messed up. That, that kind of stuff can really screw with you. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna write a book, an ebook about that. So yes, actually that's another question. Will I be re doing more ebooks? Yes, the story of the chaos war. Online terrorism is a real threat. Do I have now this segment? Like this do I have an Xbox Live, PSN, or whatever Steam account? I have Steam. I don't even remember what my Steam's called. Um, I have Xbox Live. Don't even don't even go there. Don't even go to my Xbox Live. Um, you'll get screwed over massively. Don't even try. Don't even try. Unless you want to go on some six-year tangent, get your life ruined, get your... Get that kind of crap. Okay, actually, back to my health. Teeth. My teeth have... I have gene, I have bad genes when it comes to my teeth, so my teeth are generally... Not the greatest. The reason my teeth stick out is because, um, I, I already mentioned this, I think, in my story, my life story, which was missing a lot of details, um, I was pushed by some dumb kids into concrete, I almost got a concussion, I won't lie, I almost got a concussion, I was lucky, I've almost gotten concussions, like, ten times in my life, I've been lucky that I have never suffered brain damage or a concussion, surprisingly not, um, yeah, I concrete booms like that. Um, my nose got messed up, my lip got messed up, um, my glasses almost got shattered. Um, and this, my jaw and my teeth and everything here, my jaw is actually damaged. Um, I don't know if you can tell. I don't know if it's possible to tell, but. This side is massively favored. I actually only eat with this side. This side's dirty, but also that has something to do with it. Um, this side is clean. This side is perfect. There's like no plaque even is able to even start to generate there. There's nothing. So that's when my teeth stick out. Also, that was whenever uh, most of my baby teeth were still there. These two in particular were still here, so when they grew back, um, they literally were growing. They started growing out, and then they did that. So I gotta get my teeth in on my teeth are just messed up. Um, I'll get braces eventually, but my dad just gotta live with it. I hate, I hate it too. I really do. I, I hate, I hate it. It's terrible. I hate my voice also. That's another thing. I hate my voice. Uh, I would rather have my voice that I had as. Uh, I would rather have my voice that I had as a. I'd rather have my voice that I had as a six-year-old than I would have my current voice. Um. So, that's it. That, um, so that explains all that stuff, I think. Also, oh, government conspiracies. 
Alex Jones is paid. You, there's no way. Of course he's paid for that, but... Do you think they'd let Alex Jones be on the air for almost two decades and be fine with it? No. End of the world. Okay. End of the world dates. Don't even go there. People that believe in that stuff. I don't even know what to think of you. We've had September 20th. No, September 22nd, 2015, September 23rd, September 24th, September 28th, September 29th, October 6th, October 7th, November 15th, or whatever it was, um, December 31st, or, no, September 15th, also throw that in there, Y2K, December 21st, 2011, um, May 21st, 2011, um, whatever, year, all the dates, all the dates, um, CERN, 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 March 2015, it's all bull crap, it's fear mongering, they're, the May 2011, do you see? I'm not even gonna go on that. Now, my YouTube channel questions. I promise, I'm promising a lot, but yeah. YouTube channel questions. Am I proud of my YouTube channel? Yes. I'm proud that I've been on YouTube for six years and that I continue to do it. I'm proud that I have almost 100 subscribers. I'm in the 90s at this point. Thank you for that. Um, I'm proud of the fact that I almost have 70,000 views. I have 68 something thousand views, which means a lot to me. And I value every single nice comment I get. I value all that stuff. And I will tell you what. I did delete the hate comments on, um, the Minecraft Hero by video. Minecraft Be Here by. Those people either had half a brain cell. Or just didn't play Minecraft, or just didn't know anything about it. Because if you were to actually watch the video, you'd know within minutes. The title was misleading, I'll give you that, but I got 40,000 views off of it, and people actually cared for the video. Uh, that world still exists, so I might do another tour of it. Um, I did, I massively improved that world. So. Yeah. Um, I'm sorry for my ramblings. But yes, yeah, so I'm proud of all that. Am I glad I started YouTube? Yes. Do I still have my original camera? If you're asking that, you probably don't. Um, probably don't even need to know at this point. You probably don't know my, much about me. But yeah, there it is. My first ever camera. Still works. Still excellent. Still use it. Still very good. Um, do I still have my first phone? I. It doesn't work. But there you go. It's a track phone, what a roll I cover the camel with tape, I'm paranoid about that kind of crap. Um, crap. Do I like, why, no, why do I like old YouTube videos? I'll go over that later. I like older things better, the 2000s was just the greatest to me. Oh, back to the freaking, um, stuff I did on my YouTube channel, like all my favorite TV show movies. Um. Here is my thing about my YouTube channel. Okay, here. I need to ramble, I need to ramble. My least favorite YouTube video I ever did actually is a bunch of my early 2014. Basically, all my 2014 videos and most of my 2013 videos. I actually privated most of them. I know. I've been actually losing a lot of videos recently because I've been taking them down and privating them. Because I legitimately don't even want people to see that. Like, I used to be such an idiot. I mean, my life is interesting. I'll tell you what. I really hate to say this, but I could probably, my life story is probably much more interesting than a good, like, 10% of people that live on this planet. Also, considering that I'm 10% of the people on the planet are babies, so. Yeah. Or more, probably more than that, even. Um, so. What can I say about that? Um, um, selfless or selfish? In between. Um. Then, YouTube channel stuff. How long will I do YouTube? 
Until the site either gets so corrupt I have to leave. Basically, the only time I'll quit YouTube is if I just can't do it anymore because of time. I will keep it up for as long as I possibly can, though. I will at least still try to make new videos. The only time I can really see me absolutely just quitting YouTube is if I was forced off. Which, YouTube's getting scary now. Um, what's my favorite video? Basically all of my 2010 videos. I love my Left 4 Dead review. Um, even though that was taken from Gamer Tag at least slightly, even though I love Left 4 Dead. Um, and, yeah, just my 2010 videos and some of my newer gaming videos. Um, biggest YouTube inspirations. Gamertag Tally and Boogie2988. Favorite YouTubers. Gamertag Tally, Boogie2988. YouTubers I'd like to meet. Gamertag Tally and Boogie2988. Actually, for the meeting thing, I'd rather meet um, Boogie2988 because I actually am friends with um, Gamertag Tally. I've communicated with him many times. I know quite a bit about him. Me and him are good friends at this point. Um, so I'd rather meet Boogie because I already know Gamertag Tally or Joel. Um, but, yeah. There's my YouTube stuff, I guess. Um, back to things, like back to my favorite stuff. Favorite um, TV show? Steinfeld. I have to say it. Even though a close contender is the 2003 um, Star Wars The Clone Wars series. I love that. I absolutely adore the um, 2003 version. The 2008 version is not bad. It's just not as good. It's not even close. At least to me. Um, favorite movie? Forrest Gump. Who doesn't love Forrest Gump? Favorite movie series? Star Wars. I'll just give my, my top three. Star Wars, Indiana Jones, and... Saw. Okay, I don't watch a lot of movies. Saw? Watch all of them. Watch all of them. The seventh one, the only thing I liked about the seventh one, I'll be honest, is the jigsaw scene. Um, where... I don't, I don't actually like that he was in it once, basically. The jigsaw scene and the ending. That was it. Saw 6 was pretty good. Saw 5 was... Alright. I don't see why it's considered the worst. Saw 4 was amazing. Art Blank is awesome. Um, Saw 3, pretty good. Saw 2, good. Saw 1. That was my favorite. Saw 1 was amazing. Just watch it. Um, so yeah. Saw is one of the more consistent franchises. So, yeah. Favorite band. Okay. I have a lot of favorite songs. Like, I don't know what my favorite song is. Um, but for me, with my favorite bands, I, I most of the songs I like are very different bands. Um, for consistent ones that I like the most songs from, 009 Sound System, underrated band. And for, like, legitimate stuff, I have to say Three Doors Down. I love me some Three Doors Down. Nostalgia. Oh, uh, who doesn't remember 2008? It looked like it was gonna freaking rain acid. Who remembers that? The weird, um, skies, the skies in 2008 where, like, it looked like it was about to rain acid on you? Freaking listening to Three Doors Down in a smoky little room. And all that crap. Who doesn't remember? That, that was 2008. At least for me, that was 2008. Grit. Just all that crap. Monster energy was a fad. That was how it was for me, at least. And it was awesome. <laughs> I miss 2008. Um, but yeah. That's how I remember that. But, yeah, three doors down. Good stuff. Favorite game? Star Wars Battlefront. Favorite game series? Star Wars Battlefront. Um, Least favorite game, Walking Dead Survival Instinct. Least favorite show, Walking Dead. I'm not gonna give my reason because I'll get killed, but yeah. Um, basically, uh, I have a hole in my wall, which I actually later used to feed Ethernet through here, but yeah. Um, now I'm just gonna talk about memes for a second. Um, just give you. Favorite first person shooter, um. Halo 2, 3, Call of Duty 4. I don't know, I love first person, shoot first person shooters. Favorite survival kind of game, Left 4 Dead, if you can consider that. Zombie game, Left 4 Dead is awesome. Favorite third person shooter, Battlefront. After Battlefront, either Gears of War 2. 
War Earth Defense Force 2017. Favorite um driving game, I guess. I don't know if you could consider it a driving game, but I love Skate 2. I love Skate 2. Forza Motorsport 2, um, ATV Quad Power Racing 2, Cars, whatever. Um, favorite game system, PS2. Um, favorite RPG game, Oblivion. Hey, you notice the poster back there? <laughs> yeah. Um, what I classify as a nerd? Yes. Yeah. 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 Hey, look. Look at this. This is the name of film studio. Yeah. Do I like where I live? Oh, yes, I do. Where do I live? Everybody asks that. I have to keep my location a secret for now, so I'm sorry. Um, most people know, most people that know me, um, even just online, know where I live, but I have to keep that a secret because of certain somebody that's been kind of trying to stalk me recently, but, whatever. Um, and, that's that. Um, oh, I don't know what I was talking about video games. Um, so yeah. Favorite um, RPG, Oblivion, then after that, Morrowind. Um, favorite um, sports, favorite sport, football or basketball? I love, I love both. I might actually go with basketball. Um, I've actually went to a baseball game before. That's the only one I've actually been to. Well, I have been to football before, so actually I'm wrong about that. But yeah, football um, and basketball, then baseball. Then, I, I love a lot of sports. Favorite sports game? ESPN, NFL, 2K4, and the 2K5. 2K4 and 2K5 games. Best. Um, what is your favorite um, 7th gen system? Xbox 360. Okay. What's my favorite 6th gen? Um, obviously the freaking um, PS2. Handheld, DS, or Game Boy Advance SP, I can't choose. PSP is also excellent. I love every, I love basically every game system that came out in the 2000s and the 90s. So I love my, I love myself some 2000, 2000s game, whatever. Favorite GTA game, San Andreas. Um, San Andreas 3, um, 4, Vice City. That's how it is to me. They're all excellent. I don't really care for GTA 5. I think it's underrated. Not <laughs> underrated. I think it's overrated. Um, I think that it's terrible in comparison to the other games. Massive amount of hype. GTA Online is terrible. I don't know. That's just my opinion. Scars me as well. <laughs> I'm not even gonna go into most of that stuff. I don't want to. I don't want to. Um, Chaos War questions. I'm gonna save that for the book. Um, but it was emotionally and mentally scarring. Sometimes a lot of fun. I met most of my good friends now. Most of my best friends I met through the war. So. I'm grateful for the war, for that, because I probably actually wouldn't even be where I would be. I'd probably just be some social degenerate nerd if it wasn't for them. Um, if you guys are watching this, thank you, people. And thank everybody for helping me through that crap. Um, but, yeah, I'm grateful for all the friends I met. All Basically, all my best friends I met from that, like, except for, like, Connor Mario and a few others. Um, so, yeah. Back to games. Do I like MMOs? Most of the time, no. Warcraft. Not World of Warcraft. What? World of Warcraft, yes. I'm thinking of Warcraft. Like, 1, 2, 3. I love Warcraft 1, 2, 3. Um, also, Conquest. Conquest. No, Lord of the Rings Conquest, even though that is an excellent game. Conquest. Conquest of the Rocks. It's a very unpopular game. I love it. I love it. Oh, I recommend that you guys look into it. But, yeah. So yes, uh, also people ask me what is my compost guild. I can't tell that. Because people have actually tried to hack us before. Um, so yeah, we, we, we've, we have this um, Canadian um, guild that's been trying to hack us for some reason. I have nothing against Canadians. Um, but, yeah. I don't know why. Oh, also, one of my favorite, um, online movie makers came from Canada. John C. J. Graham. RB and the Chiefs. Gold. Check out RB and the Chiefs. Especially the early episodes. 
comedy gold, then later ones for more story. Um, yeah. So, now, I'm gonna go to Ferris Farris movie. Six, I love three also. Episode three, it's not crapped on as much as, um, the episode, like, one, two, but episode three is actually very good. At least to me it is. Um, so now you're a kid, you don't even know what a good movie is. Episode 6 is my favorite one of the one memories, but also I do acknowledge that episode 5 is the best. But yeah. Oh yeah, favorite music, um, listening device, like favorite iPod, Android, or favorite like smartphone, whatever you want to call it. iPod 4, I guess, I don't know. But if you're, if you're gonna talk about like all the stuff like this, um, this is my thing here. Three doors down. I got a lot of three doors down here. Um, so that's pretty interesting stuff there. Only 30 minutes so far. Um, but, yeah, this thing is starting to get a little hot. Um, so that I might be, like, moving around. I might teleport a little bit. <laughs> I might do some teleportation now. But yeah. Um, I don't know what to talk about next. Um, I guess I could talk about my favorite, um, I don't know, I don't know what to talk about right now. There's a lot I could talk about. Um, my, my favorite Lego set. The favorite one I've owned, and I don't do many. Um, no, but. I think my favorite would either be the, um, AT, the, um, I don't know what it's called now, Lego Agents, um, four-wheeler chase or whatever, the one I did a review on, 2010, in the Clone Troopers Battle Pack. That's just me. Um, my favorite computer game that's not, like, like a computer exclusive, I guess I could say, um, Conquest? Or Warcraft, or World of Warcraft. Maybe Warcraft, um, one or two or three. I don't know. Um, my voice is so bad. Counter Strike. I love Counter Strike on um, 1.6. Then I also love. Um, I know it's not PC. Well, from 2009, it was PC exclusive when I played it. Minecraft. I love the older ver the older versions of Minecraft, like Minecraft Classic and everything. You know, and sort of thing. Um, I love that stuff. So. What is, why do I hate, why am I, like, or is it, new fag, old fag, old fag, I don't know if I, <laughs> that's all I got to say. I do not, I, I basically was bred to live the 2000s lifestyle, um, so I'm not used to any of this new culture, and honestly, it's disgusting to me, it's terrible, I don't know how people are even able to live like this, I'm surprised that the world hasn't completely broken down. In the current citizen, it's terrible. Society is collapsing. In my opinion, it's, there's a lot of contributing factors, but nine, nine. I'm not even gonna mention anything else. So, yes, I, and of course, oh, stupid kids, stupid kids, stupid kids have been around forever. I know. Search up freaking Halo Two kids talk, talking crap or whatever. I know. I know, but it wasn't as bad back then. It wasn't as bad back then. Um, of course there were worse things like two the um 9/11 terror attacks were terrible. Yeah. Also, person I'd like to meet from history, probably JFK. JFK, John F. Kennedy. I wish he didn't die. Um, when he did. So, yeah. That's all I gotta say about that. Um, government conspiracies, Tower Seven. Ah, freaking idiots. Um, sorry. Um, now future of my channel. I'm gonna do a variety of videos. I'm gonna do like Boogie Time and A style videos, like how I just sit here like this and ramble about stuff. Maybe I'll make like comedy videos. I don't know. No, I don't have a variety of content. More gaming videos as well. Um, 
or my thoughts on dubstep. I despise dubstep. Um, the, I, well, I don't despise all dubstep. Um, there's some that I like. I even like Benny or anybody. Relax, that's one of my, um, only, like, only dubstep songs I really like. That one's actually pretty good, though. Um, oh, I should do the Legends video song. Yep, um, what's my favorite genre of music? Pop or rock? Basically, um, if you want to know what most of my favorite songs are, um, Sing Star Pop 1 and 2. There you go. <laughs> um, then a few other ones. So, yeah. Like, you got Three Doors Down, um, oh, I love 2000s and 90s music and 80s and 70s. I especially love, um, 2000s music, um, late 90s, early 2000s, or, like, Basically all three thousands. Of course, if you're trash, you always trash, but you know. Yeah, just oh, I love it. I love it. Every single night, I listen to some old two thousand songs. Every single night, I need to about that. I just, I need it for the soul. Um, but yeah, that's just me. Um, now, what's my favorite movie soundtrack? Indiana Jones or Star Wars. The Saw soundtrack is excellent. Um, nowhere close. Doesn't even see. It can't even see them. It can't even freaking see them. Oh, also Forrest Gump had an excellent soundtrack. Um, a lot of movies have excellent music. But yeah, John Williams is a god. Um, yeah. That's what I have to say about that. Um, I'm thinking of um, YouTube poop right now. I love YouTube poop. Especially um, The King Buys a Wii, where he's like, he has the Wii roll that's like facing outwards, he's like, it's like the dumbest thing ever, it's so funny. Ah, oh, just look it up, like, <laughs> it's the dumbest thing ever. And I love stupid crap. I love stupid crap. I love broken YouTube subtitles. It's, I love all that stuff. It's funny. My voice is just killing itself right now. Oh yeah, also, do I wear glasses? Um... I have a knife, by the way. Um, so sorry, knife. Who cares? I have a knife. Of course, I have a knife. Um, do I wear glasses? Mm, currently, no. Do did I wear glasses? Yes, I did. I think I need new ones. I probably actually should start wearing them again, but I don't know. Let's see here. Oh yeah. Would I do any weird challenges? Um, for money, it depends. Um. I put up those naked photos of myself for a thousand off. Part of me would say yes, but part of me would say no. Probably no. Um, so yeah, I got my... I still have my glasses and they're killing me right now, so... I don't know if I'm seeing things clear. I gotta get up. Here, holy crap, this actually it might be either really good or really bad. I can't even tell. The colors are much more vibrant. Everything looks better now. Everything just looks clearer. Um, the colors are more vibrant. The colors are definitely more vibrant right now. Um, yeah, colors are definitely more vibrant. I love color. Um, I, I actually have um, like color. I have color deprivation. If that is even a thing. If there's a huge lack of color, it can make me sick. So, color. Color and focus. I'm gonna start wearing my glasses again. I'm gonna finish with all my glasses. I don't give a crap if I look like an idiot or what. I'm gonna see. Also, these glasses are very comfortable, so I'll start wearing them again. Um, do I like Pokemon? Like card games? Do I like card games? Um, Pokemon. Uh, I like the Pokemon games, the old ones. I do. I do happen to have a um collection here of um. Hold on. I need one without this kind of crap. Okay, I see what I mean now. I'm taking these off. I actually can't wear these right now. I'm doing I'm doing else in there. So I can't wear these right now. But yes, I need to wear glasses. Oh, interesting all here. I have Come on! Also, hey, for the 
2009 kid series and stuff, Monster Energy. I did not drink any of this. I actually I drank, I drank like a little bit, but I do not like Monster Energy. I just think that the cans look cool. Um, but I do happen to have a collection of um Pokemon cards ranging from 1999 to 2006. Basically, the HP thing. Until they change that to the small thing next to 50 or whatever the hell it's gonna be. I stopped. Also, the, for me though, I do like card games because, um. I love. I love me some freaking. Magic the Gathering. I love Magic the Gathering. I'm a freaking nerd. I don't care if I'm a nerd. I do like it. Wow. I don't. Yeah, I just got. Yeah. Yeah. I love magic. What can I say? Magic the Gathering. It's awesome. I have some pretty rare cards, too. I don't have any of the old ones because I just started getting into magic like 2014, 2015. Yeah. So, um, I think I'm not going to go for much longer now because it's been 41 minutes. And this thing's starting to get kind of hot. So, yeah. Um, do I like arcade compilations? I love them. Actually, I'm using a stack of games to hold this up. I have Xbox Live Arcade Unplugged, Geometry Wars, oh, Geometry Wars. The one that comes on there, play this. I almost said play that shit. Play that shit, I don't care. Um, <laughs> um, Marvel Blast Ultra, that game's actually very fun. It's only a demo, but that demo is one of the best demos of all time. Um, I have the Xbox Live Arcade compilation disc with the play staff support on it. Zuma, um, Tag Team Championship Edition, um, all that stuff. There's so many good games on there. I swear, Bejeweled 2, um, I love Geometry Wars, though. I might actually have to play some of that here. Um, so, yeah. And, what is my favorite social media? Twitter or MySpace? I don't use social media that much. I just have Twitter and MySpace. Um, MySpace. <laughs> when was the last time you ever freaking heard someone talk about MySpace? It's irrelevant, but I still use it just for the nostalgia. I say nostalgia, by the way. It's a joke. Um, nostalgia critic versus AGN. The guy spelled the um description nostalgia instead of nostalgia. I made it a joke in my one video on the Lego Batman Calc 2 where they return to the police station. Nostalgia. Um, I've always that's just been a running gag between me and my one friend. Um, you know who you are, by the way. Um. But, yeah, I, I, I don't know why, but I always mess with stuff when I'm making videos like this. But, yeah. So, I don't know. Do I collect toys? I collect Legos. I guess you could say I have a Lego collection. Um, I also have a pretty big bin down here of the old, uh, I have the older cars. I said I have the older cars. These are all from childhood, and they're pretty cool, actually. They're Cool. Um, I have. It's 1980. 1998, I think this is. I have these. They look cool. Um, so yeah, I guess I collect toys. Um, do I collect action figures? I have Star Wars action figures from a long time ago. That's it. Um, what action figure would I consider buying? The uh, Master Chief Halo 2 um, action figure that was in RB and the Chief. Um, what collector's item would I continue or continue or consider buying? I might have said continue earlier. Halo 3 Master Chief helmet. Um, either that. I don't know. There's some cool collector's items I'd like. Yeah, there are some cool things I would like, but that'd be one of them. Um. What is the rarest in my own? It's kind of sad to say, but Star Wars Battlefront 2 for the original Xbox. Or Earth Defense Force 2017 for the 360. Um, those are my two rarest. Earth Defense Force is not worth much, but it's just a harder to find game. You can't really find it in stores like anywhere at this point. Um, yeah. 
what are my what's my stance on retro games now? I don't really care. Um, I like my Atari flashback two and my Intellivision flashback. Um, snafu. What games do I play the most? Um, depends. Events. It's all. It's all over for me. It just depends on what kind of mood I'm in. There's certain times where I'll play a bunch of Battlefront. Um, I'll play a bunch of Bo uh, Oblivion, GT4, whatever it is. I, I don't know. Um, sometimes I'll just not play a game for like a month. I've done that before. Um, yeah. What is my um favorite Lego game? A lot of people ask that. Lego Indiana Jones: The Original Adventures. Followed up by Lego Star Wars the video game. Lego Star Wars the video game has a lot of nostalgia to me. Or nostalgia. <laughs> but yeah. Um. Yeah. Also, um. People will ask, why do I keep my old dog's toys? These are being saved for the future. But also just because I have problems with letting go of things and change. At this point, I'm over my dog's death. I am. I am. Um. But I will always have these toys. Because we, in particular, have a toy that was the first one we ever bought him. Still here. So, I have these for a few reasons. But, yeah. Um. What is my most incomplete Lego set? That yeah, was big. It's pathetic. Ah! Ah, it hurts. And that actually did not hurt whatsoever. I'm not going to do that again, though. I made a freaking video, um, like, a year ago, just bashing my head with a box. That was freaking retarded. Um, <laughs> El Presidor, he's also somewhat of an inspiration for, like, inspiration? Inspiration for the Juice Brotherhood videos. Um, so yeah. This has been 47 minutes. Um, and then I'm going to wrap things up here. Um, also, I do collect, um, I have some toy cards. That's not really a collection. What is my favorite poster? Oh, I, I'll show you my favorite poster. I have Marvel for 3 up there. I'm taking that down. I'm taking that Lego Pirates of the Caribbean down. I have all that crap. Um, Star Wars Monopoly. I, I did not actually get that. Um, whatever. But yeah, it's pretty cool. I have that there. Um, painting or picture or whatever there. Painting, but you know. That from Mexico City. Um, I'm living poster. Well, not poster. Oh yeah, that actually is from Mexico City. Retrieved from a temple. Not by any of my family, but a long time ago. So that was like the 80s or something. Yeah, that was sold. So that's pretty cool. Also, if you notice the red on my wall, I was an idiot through all over my dang wall. Also, here's the hole. I feed on internet. Do that now. Internet, whatever. I like Ethernet. I don't know why people bitch about Ethernet. I mean, I swear. Why do people bitch about um, Ethernet cables? Like, what the fuck do you want with me? Like, ah, why do you people hate me for um, liking Ethernet cables? They're... Ah, uh, it hurts my mind. I've seen people burn Ethernet cables before because they hate them so bad. Really? Really? I'll put it under your bed. I don't know. People are strange. Also, yeah, I am mad that the Wii does not have Ethernet. I am very mad about that. I'm, I'm mad that the Wii U does not have Ethernet. That's pathetic. Um, also, my Wii U's data could not be retrieved. So, because of that. Thank you, also, because my gamepad was shattered by my dog two years ago. Um, yeah, what's my favorite custom Lego creation? My original base up here. Um, then the base next to it. But, that's all for that is my, do I like my room? Everybody, I already kind of answered that. Yes, I do. I like my room quite a bit. I've reverted it to how it used to be. You know, there are some things in it I'd like to change. One thing in particular, only one person in this freaking planet besides me even knows what it is, but you know. Um, it's a very specific thing out there, so... Yeah. Um, so yeah, there's only a few things I have to change, really. Why do I have stuffed animals on it? Nostalgia. Um, also, one of them in particular. But, yeah, I just have them there because memories. 
Already the blanket the other half was buried with him. Um, so, yeah. So, would you ever. Oh, this is one. Would I ever consider joining the military? No. No, I would not. Do I ever consider getting paid through YouTube? No. Um. Because I don't want to have to deal with the copyright music thing. Would I consider. Um. Doing a YouTube red show if they offered me to. Unless it was about the chaos, unless it was like a reenactment of the chaos where I probably didn't know that. Why would people want to pay for that? Oh, because I still have actually, um, um, that war was very strange to the point, it's not even a real war, I just called a war, we all just called a war because that was the next game. Um, every single person basically, except for like maybe like two or three, who even fought in that war whatsoever, documented. All that stuff's documented. There are some films and stuff for games that don't like theater and all that crap. Some stuff is not recorded, but actually a lot of our, especially the Halo 3 stuff, that's documented. That's all documented. Um, so yeah, I don't know why people would want to pay for that kind of crap. I wouldn't, certainly. But yeah. Do I, do I have headphones? It doesn't have headphones. I mean, they're all right, but I don't want to use headphones because I'm always, I'm always paranoid of jump scares and all that kind of crap. Screamers, I'm paranoid of that kind of stuff. I mean, like, I'm extremely paranoid. Like, there have been times, I don't know. I'm also paranoid about um, bugs on light switches. Yeah. So, that is it for my Q&A. That is it. Oh, actually, one final. Do I like um? Do I like having my games for collecting or playing both? I want I buy them to play them, but I also would like for their labels to be original, not great. platinum hits, greatest hits, whatever, none of that crap. I would like them to, to be in good condition. I prefer them to have the manual. I want them to have at least have the case in them. Um, artwork. The only game I really don't have that for besides like the GameStop stuff, which I just keep for nostalgia. Years of War Two. An Xbox Live um, arcade compilation. So, yeah. Also, for older games like Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color games, it'd be cold out of the box. I only have one in box. Um, complete. I only have one complete in box. Um, Game Boy Color game. I actually only have one box Game Boy Color game. Um, and that's like wild too. That's not expensive. That's like twenty bucks. Um, oh, even even though um, my Namco Museum for the Game Boy Advance just came with a manual, which is pretty cool. Um, so, yeah. Oh, underrated Game Boy Advance game, Cars. Just try it. Um, I'm gonna make a video about that, Ty. Game review. I'm not gonna make a game review. Maybe I will. I don't know. I probably won't. So, yeah, people have been asking me that game review will come back. No, probably not, because that show's history is bloodstained. Not bloodstained, but you know what I mean. Um, also, if you ask me, how many times have I have an entry? Um, um, think about, I know that your blood, you, blood comes back into your body, and you get blood back, um, but, think about my body right now, I've probably, over the time of my life, lost about half of my blood in my body, even, it's come, it's came back, but, yeah, I've probably lost about half of that, and then it came back, not all at once, but over time, I've lost quite a bit of blood, I've had a lot of injuries, over the years, especially the smashing in the concrete. I mean, also I got smashed in the wood chips. That one didn't. I got. I was bleeding. I was bleeding, and it hurt really bad. But I didn't. I that was. I was bleeding. I had scrapes and all that kind of crap, bruises. But I did not have any like injuries. So, also that that we look. Me and my friends look back at that, and we kind of actually laugh at that. Cause I like ate those neck things. So yeah. That is my Q and A at fifty four minutes, almost fifty five minutes. My longest video of all time. See you. Yeah. Thank you all for watching this Q and A. Um, I hope this is uploaded to YouTube. It might not be actually. So if you're seeing this in your city, if you, if you sat through it all, thank you. And more videos will come soon. I want to make more videos. So. Yep. Thank you very much for that. And I'll see you all later.
hand, didn't it? 